Hello and welcome to ACN Academy's YouTube channel. In this video, we'll be talking about the new recruitment opportunity and a detailed notification which has been released by Steel Authority of India Limited, uh, which is a public sector undertaking company and um, they will be recruiting without gate examination. So last year they recruited through gate examination, but this year they are recruiting without gate examination for 124 management trainee positions, technical. Right, and uh, the branches which are supposed to be included are chemical, civil, computer, electrical, instrumentation, mechanical, and metallurgy, and number of posts also you can see branch wise as well. Uh, there was previous notification, a uh, brief notification was released, but and it was circulating online, uh, but there. Uh, they had not mentioned which branches and number of vacancies were there. So here they have in the detailed notification specifically mentioned what will be the engineering discipline and how many number of positions shall be considered for that. And apart from that, how many number of reservations, um, uh, reservation uh, criteria as well they have mentioned but not branch wise they have mentioned, right? They have not mentioned it branch wise. Right, and uh, relaxation criteria, upper age limit 28 years as on 5th of uh, December 2025. Minimum qualification that you need to have 65% marks in your engineering degree and on the basis of that you are supposed to uh, appear for the examination. Uh, that is your computer based examination over here and um, uh, rather than only particular engineering domain, they have also mentioned that what engineering domain shall be mentioned on your degrees. Right, so sometimes equivalent degrees are also there. Uh, so for chemical engineering, it is chemical engineering or technology, electrochemical engineering, they will be eligible. Civil, only civil people will be eligible, not civil and structural, civil and environmental, they won't be eligible. Only civil engineering, core civil engineering shall be there. For computer science, so computer science, computer science engineering, information technology, computer science and information technology or three years of master degree in uh, uh, computer applications. So M MCA students can also apply for computer uh, vacancies. Uh, electrical, you can see electrical engineering, electrical machines, power systems, uh, high voltage engineering, power plant engineering, electronics and power engineering, power electronics engineering, all of these uh, you can see, you can take a screenshot of this if you want, uh, will be eligible and similarly for instrumentation as well, electronics, electronics and instrumentation, electronics communication, electronics telecommunication, control uh, and uh, applied electronics engineering, these are the main uh, engineering domains, robotics is also there, automation or automation and robotics, communication engineering it can be considered for mechanical, mechanical people, mechanical and automation is also eligible over here, uh, production, industrial engineering, indus production technology, mechanical production and tool engineering, industrial engineering technology, mechatronics is also eligible over here, uh, energy engineering, machine engineering, mechatronics and automation engineering, metallurgy, material sciences and metallurgical engineering and industrial metallurgy, right. And relaxation will be there in the qualification by five marks for SCST candidates and PWBD candidates, right? And uh, there will be a consideration of creamy layer, right? So non-creamy layer shall be there for OBC. Medical standards have are required to be fulfilled as well. And also the selection process, it will be without gate examination and the tentative uh, examination date will be in January or February. So during the time of gate examination only this examination can be conducted. And over here, you you need to choose the test centers as well uh, according to you know try to because most of the students who will be appearing for this examination will be also going for gate exam as well. So try to you know choose the same city in which you are living in right now as your test center, right? And no request for the change of examination center will be acknowledged afterwards. To be eligible uh, for GD and interview, a candidate will have to qualify the each part of the test. So there will be a knowledge test, aptitude test. Those should also be uh, cleared, right? In this entire examination, 200 marks will be there. And the first part will be comprising your domain knowledge, 40, duration, 40 minutes, 100 marks. And second part will be comprising of aptitude test, 80 minutes and 100 marks will be there, right? So 100, 100 will be there. And in which you'll see there will be four segments, quantitative aptitude, English, reasoning, general awareness. So you are supposed to qualify both of these tests individually and then, uh, then only you'll be shortlisted for group decision and interview, right? 
and apart from that the students will be shortlisted for uh, gd and interview it will be in the ratio of 1 to 3 so that means for three times more number of vacancies students will be selected right and uh, the weightage of cbt group discussion and interview has been given 75% weightage will be given to the computer based test 10% to the gd and 15% to the interview so combine gd and interview 25% right so you need to take uh, take care of that in mind uh, apart from that biometric verification also will be there training and probation you can see the training period will be of one year and during that uh, period try to be you know well behaved uh, accordingly and try to perform better so that your uh, re remuneration turns out to be a permanent remuneration in future so uh, it will be a basic pay of 50000 rupees per month and uh, 50 to 160000 on successful completion of training after one year your pay package will become 60 to 180000 rupees per month right and uh, this becomes a cdc of 16 to 17 lakhs per annum and this will be an even grade placement will be wherever there will be the considerations of you know the sale authority of uh, steel authority of india limited plants and for that you need to go to the official website sale.co.in salecareers.com uh, so that you are eligible for the job opportunity right and you can fill out the form as well 300 rupees will be the form fee and on the basis of that you can appear uh, it is a eight page document and this can be downloaded from the official website of sale authority of india limited right apart from that you can see the commencement of the online registration will be 15th of uh, november 2025 and the closing date will be 5 december 2025 right so it's a wonderful opportunity do appear for this examination as well apart from gate exam uh, fill in the form and um, I'll see you in the next video. Like this video and share it with your friends if you think it will be helpful for them. Thank you.